people training in counselling and psychotherapy in TA have the discount matrix as a model of discounting, which is a is a is a very useful detailed model, which is in my experience quite difficult to use. And so when I went off and did some organisational training, I came across the Steps to Success, which is developed by Julie Hay. And I'm sorry, those of you that are organisational will already know this this model, but I think this is a fabulous model to um, to teach people and to use. It's so much more user friendly than the discount matrix, while acknowledging the usefulness of the discount matrix. Let me just say. <laughs> so, can you can you see this or not? I can see from where your pen is now. Yes. All right. So, different. It's just the discount matrix in another form. Situation, significance. I don't spell well, by the way those of you that don't know me. Um, situation, significance, solution, especially not when I'm on video, um, skills. There's no pressure here, is there, Leilani? No, to no. <laughs> Strategy, success. <laughs> Need another I don't step. know if you can see that at all, can you? Yes, I can, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. if you just hold so, it about there, yeah, that's perfect. So discounting, the, the theory of discounting is about an internal mechanism uh, where, uh, which involves the person minimizing or ignoring some aspect of self, others or the reality situation. Did you like the way I just came out with that definition without even looking it up? I'm impressing myself That now. was really smooth, <laughs> Leilani. <laughs> Very nice. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> um, so this is about blind spots and about different levels levels of ways that we sort of filter things out. So as I said, it's just like the discount matrix. It, it lacks some of the detail of the discount matrix, but it's for me, it's so much more user friendly. So the discounting at the situation level might be someone um, not even knowing that they've got a problem. So not even knowing that they've got a, a hacking cough, for example. The next one might be someone that knows that they've got a hacking cough but doesn't, but discounts that it's important. Oh yeah, I've had that for years. It's not important. This, the solution level then is about discounting that there's a solution. Yes, I've got a hacking cough. Um, I know I'm probably really ill, but that's just how things are. The next one is around personal skills. I've got a hacking cough. I know I'm, I'm seriously ill. I know other people can find cures for their cough, but I'm just, I can't get myself organized to get to the doctors. Discounting the skills. Strategy then is either not having a strategy or having a strategy that's not going to get people where they want. I've got a hacking cough, I'm seriously ill, I know I can get myself organized and I'll do it one day. And then discounting the success level is just about not getting round to it. So and what I'm going to do is I'm going to phone up the doctor tomorrow. And this is a, this is a lovely, simple model, um, as I said, that we can share with other people and we can hold in our heads. And, and I use this when I'm teaching, when I'm, when I'm facilitating. This is one of the models I used with the writers group to help them to think about, so what, what level are they discounting at? And, the, and the real, I think the real beauty of the whole concept of discounting is this idea of meeting people where they are, that it's so important when we're facilitating people, because we can often see other people's blind spots, um, we're often up working up here at the strategy level about what they can do differently, when they might be right down here at the um, yeah, situation level.